Dun 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 dun. <laughs> oh man, this is one of the last remaining COD games that I have on uh, this channel right here. So I got about what eight minutes on this shit, almost nine. <laughs> What was I gonna talk about? Oh yeah, this whole campers versus rushers debate. This shit is annoying. I don't know who's bitching so hard about the damn play style, but look, hear me out. There's pros and cons to both, man. To be a great Call of Duty player, in my opinion, is you gotta be able to do both. All right. Oh, shh, watch this. Oh! As I get Ultimo teabagged right there. But if you ask me, the greatest players are the ones who knows their strengths and weaknesses. Alright? Some of these YouTubers really irritate me with this weak-ass bully mentality that they got this hard on that they got for that shit oh yeah you just want you to dumb around and run around like we are no a lot of big youtubers want folks to run around like that just so they can get high kds they not telling you what's they not telling you something real man i'm a big fan of if it's working keep doing it and if you are camping and you're getting kills Obviously that works for you if you could run around with your quick draw speedy submachine guns or whatever the fuck and Just mow down 50 people at once you do it But then again everybody will call you a fucking hacker or say you're sweaty ass try hard or or worse complain about skilled based matchmaking <laughs> Shit's annoying but it's been brought to my attention that uh, oh shit teammate just died here didn't even notice me but my aim is ass I got teabagged yet again don't worry I'll pick it up I pick it up don't worry about that but I also still got horrible gameplays to upload after this from black ops that would be pretty funny to watch. But anyway, back on topic. It's nothing wrong with camping, alright? There isn't. Finally, damn, I shot somebody. It's nothing wrong with camping, and there's nothing wrong with rushing. If you can do either or, that's fine. That's your strength. But imagine, just for a second, imagine rushing in and then somebody is dropping the threshers they're dropping fucking what else is in here I know it's not just a, a thresher it's snipers nests I heard him I heard him I don't see him anymore but I, I best believe I heard him he's behind me now oh shit did he see me where the hell did he go where is he there he is die Oh, uh, yep, yep, ninja, out of here. But, yeah, if you could do either or, that's great. That makes you a versatile player. Because the reasons people give for you not to camp, because I'm mowing these two now. The reasons people give for you not to camp, I, 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 it's one of some of the most asinine things. It ruins the fun for everyone else. Like getting shotgunned on a five bar connection to a two is fun. Like going up against a nine man party is fun. It's not. Damn, I got blown. I got blown like a CEO. <laughs> yeah, but like I'm saying, there's a whole bunch of things here that ruin. I would say ruins the game for me, my experience at least. Camping is the least 
of my worries. But someone else's fun shouldn't be anyone it shouldn't be the responsibility of someone else for everyone's fun. That sounds so fucking stupid. And it always be these big ass YouTubers. Like how do y'all blindly follow that shit? That's so ass. <laughs> oh, kill streaks is going in now. But I bring it up because a lot of people want you to play this game the way they want you to play it. And if I know anything about playing this game for as long as I've been playing, not just Black Ops 4, but Call of Duty in general, shish, is somebody else's style may not work for you, alright? In this game, as long as you're not hacking or, you know, glitching, you do what you gotta do. If you can only get kills from camping, then camp your balls off. But if you are, like, Marka J-esque, then hey. Go nuts. Rush to your heart's content. It's all about what works for you. Who the hell? Who is this? Who? Whomst? Boy. As I just give this team the hardest D imaginable. <laughs> I'm a solo player. I don't just play with like a six man party that calls out every fucking time somebody shoots at me. That's annoying. But again, it's legitimate. You know, it's it's a legitimate playstyle. You're not hacking the game, you're not glitching, you're not cheating. You, you know, you're doing what you gotta do. That's just a part of the game. Now game is almost up we are thrashing these kids as so I get another sniper's nest I was thinking the whole time I should probably go back to Black Ops 4 man I was treated so kindly I was treated so I don't know what it's like on Modern Warfare but I was treated so kindly but man if anybody's bitching about you playing a certain way even if you're trolling Understand this, you spent 60 bucks for the game. Maybe 100, depending on which type you got. I never go to 100, but if you did, again. You bought the game, you play how you want to play. Damn, why he just ether me? <laughs> you play how you want to play, man. Get off these YouTubers' dick, blindly following them, because they don't know what they're talking about. They, they own some bullshit. <laughs> okay? Do what you want to do. That's all I got to say, man. This game is coming to a close. I think I went 25 and 5. Let's see. Let me show the score. Show the score. Uh, it's not the highest gameplay, but come on, man. That's another thing folks don't talk about. Like They got these little big-ass Russian heavy guns, and they want you to go around rushing with like a LMG or a sniper or some shit. Like, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I wish I had a team of campers back at me. Fuck. Spawn watching for me. Anyway. I'm out.